Good morning, everybody. Um, it's another beautiful day out here. It feels like it's uh, in the in the low 80s, and I say it feels like it because I went to my phone app to see what uh, the temperature is, but uh, and it says that um, Corona's having a tornado right now. So I kind of don't think so. So, so much for that. Uh, in store for today, it's um, got to see what I can get done. Uh, I have zero dollars in the account. In fact, I'm overdrawn about 300 bucks. I also have absolutely no gasoline in my truck. I still don't have tags for it. Uh, they just barely cashed the check. They wouldn't let me. Um, they would not let me um, pay it online when I had the money. So. What I need to do, and I have so little gas in my truck right now, I'm going to see what I have in my uh, lawnmower can. I'm going to put that into my uh, tank. And um, I have a check that my mom gave me to try to survive until um, other checks come. So, and that'll probably be late this afternoon, if at all. So, um, I've got to make these deposits before I put gas in my car. I hope it takes me all the way to the bank and to the uh, gas station. So that's today. And uh, after that, this is also one of the reasons why I haven't been able to uh, look on my app for jobs because I have no gas in my car. So I'll see if I, if I can get it deposited and there's an actual positive amount in there I could fill the tank and uh, then I can go from there but it's already Tuesday and I'm leaving next Monday to North Carolina so that's the day going swimmingly so far my little lizard friend is out again no that one's different this one has a longer tail I don't know if you guys can see him right there on the drain pipe <laughs> hey there, little lizard guy. You want to puff your chin out again? You puff it's your chin out? I had one bite me. Ah! There's these big bees flying around too, and I don't like them. They don't bite me. Bye, little lizard guy! I'm not coming any closer because of the big bees. So I got out my gas can for my uh, lawnmower and it's empty. It's got a couple of ounces in there, not even worth opening. So I'm hoping to get to the bank before, uh, to, before getting to the gas station because uh, I have zero dollars to do this. So. Give it a try. She's my little girl. <laughs> Wait a minute. I'm your little girl. <laughs> and she's my little four-legged girl. Oh, okay. <laughs> hey, Angel. You're just so cute, Angel. Yes, you are. <laughs> uh, big yawn. <laughs> So lay right there. So I am on empty. I've got the light screaming at me saying I'm on fumes. Let's see what I can get. Okay, so there's a banking kiosk real close to um, an Arco just down the street from here, and I'm going to head to that. Um, that will probably be the best way to, or the quickest way to get this done. Because the bank is too far away. And uh, the closest gas station to that is a uh, 76, which is really high right now. Uh, okay, so there's the little kiosk that I could deposit my check. I hope they'll allow me to withdraw something. 
All right, so my bank allowed me to withdraw $20. So I get to put $20 of gas in my tank. Um, I don't know how, so that pretty much means I'm done for the day. I'm gonna have to go home. But uh, $20 of gas, I don't know how much that's gonna actually put into my tank. But uh, yeah, I don't know if that's gonna get me anywhere either. So I'll have to see. All right, so $20, $20 not quite half a gallon, half a tank, but that'll last me uh, pretty much the rest of the week. Unless I uh, start working, then who knows. Um, so that's it for today as far as mo running around. Okay, so I finally mounted my camera so you guys can actually see me. Um, if it wasn't for Miss Mary, I wouldn't have a camera to record with, so thanks. Thank you, Miss Mary. Um, because um, I may have, I mentioned yesterday that two of my cameras are not working and everything that we've bought has been, uh, we bought used because we got some relatively nice stuff for relatively cheap and I like to do that but you always know that you're, you get something that's a couple of years old it may be halfway through its life already so that's, I can turn the air conditioner on now. All right, so a couple of things you're probably wondering about. Some, those of you who have probably been with us since the beginning know everything that's going on, but uh, obviously yeah, I lost my job about a year and a half ago now. A um, year and a quarter, I guess. And uh, three years ago, uh, I started seeing signs that uh, things were going sour in my department. My department company did not really want a human resources department because we kept telling them things that they didn't want to hear. So they really wanted to just put their vice president in charge of everything and just put um, people in that department that just do paperwork and shut up. So that's basically what happened. And for two years I knew that they were trying to get rid of me. They fired my boss and then they were going to get rid of me. It took them two years to do it because <clears throat> they really had no reason to get rid of me. I bought this truck about two years ago and, I, the re and probably people are wondering why did you get such a great big gas guzzling truck? Or why don't you buy a little tiny um, you know, fuel efficient car? It'll help you out. But when I saw the writing on the wall that I was going to get terminated, I, um, I purposely went looking for a truck. So that's it. So I bought the truck knowing that I was probably going to end up doing something that involved this truck. So um, that was kind of important. And uh, I knew it was probably going to be in construction or, or uh, uh, home improvement or something that uh, I was going to need the truck. I also have, I'm, I'm also a musician. I'm going to need the truck for, uh, for hauling equipment. Yeah, that's where I stand right now. And um, so this idea of the handyman company um, is, sounds great. And um, I was going to try to get my first jobs, but I had no gas in the car, no money to get gas. And uh, so I'll take a look when I get home and see what's available. Now I can't look too far ahead because of uh, on Monday I uh, I'm flying out to be with uh, Val and her family thanks to my mom who paid for the ticket to go out there and uh, right now I'm still waiting for some checks so that I could pay them be pay the checks the, the bills before I leave so that they don't turn off uh, utilities at home. So um, that's, that's why I have to wait. I'm, I'm still waiting for some checks. So that's my story and I'm sticking to it. Hello guys. Yes, I know. It's dark. I'm on green screen. It's not a walking dead. It's just me filming at night outside. I'm getting in the car with Crystal. <laughs> and we're going to Target. And the reason why we're making a late night run to Target is because my colored pencils are getting this big. Yeah, that's right. I need more colored pencils. Kevin is sending me some, but I'm like out of some of the colors I really, really need to do more coloring tonight. 
Mm -hmm. And I took a nice long nap today, so I'm going to be up coloring late. So I'm heading to Target with Miss Crystal over there. Hey. Okay, guys, I broke down. I can't find Artist Loft pencils anywhere but at Michael's or AC Moore or one of the art stores, but I got Crayola My coloring God. pencils. Yep. There's 50 in here, and they had some colors that I didn't have, so I'm going to be able to continue coloring tonight. Yes! So I know, cool. I know. Crazy, crazy, crazy. So but we are on our way home now, then I got to film my Walking Dead, and then and back color. to coloring. Yay! Maybe Crystal will stay downstairs, and we'll sit by the dining room table and color tonight for a while. Sure. Yay! So, anyway, we'll see you when we get there. Say bye. Bye. Well, everybody, it's that time of night, and no, we're not home yet, but I am closing out for the night. It's been a long day. Even though I got a good nap in today, it was still a long day, and I still got a long night ahead of me because I have got 50 new colored pencils I can color with. Yay! <laughs> and Krista got a new coloring book, so we're going to be up for a while doing some coloring. Mm-hmm. Yep. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed hanging out with us today. If you did, please give us a great big thumbs up. And if you have not done so already, please press that little red subscribe button down below. Crystal. It's down below. Uh-huh. Yeah. And help your neighborhood community to grow. And yeah. share this video. With everybody. You know. And strangers. That's right, even if you don't know them. Just walk up to them and say, hey. The neighbors, check them out on YouTube. That's right. We're amazing. That's well, They're amazing, but I'm in it now, so we're amazing. <laughs> That's right. And we will see all of you guys tomorrow. tomorrow. Bye. Bye. <laughs>